What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. We about to get into uh, my good sis voice for the people. DDG tired of people speaking on his family. Reginate to car blah, 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 blah. Let's get it. Carter, while racing. Oh, 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 oh. Y'all. First of all. Carter, while racing. Oh, 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 oh. When y'all, I tell y'all, so this girl then fell and scraped all in our face up and everything. We was racing. <laughs> I I like racing a man. I'm glad it's not worse than what it is. The next day is definitely going to be the worst day. Ooh. So hopefully she ain't got nothing to do. Y'all leave y'all comments down below oh, and send lots of love to Regina and Carter. Halle Bailey was trending yesterday after DDG's video with his son was going viral. When you get there, everybody want to say hi to you. He's the cutest. You gotta Make sure you, you be, be be nice to the director and the producer so you can get some minutes too, okay? Okay. <gasps> okay. <laughs> <laughs> said okay. Okay. Daryl. He's such a cutie. He just said okay. Let yeah, you be talking, okay? Someone tweet, if you had to keep rotating the baby's torso to hide his face, just stay off the damn internet. Someone else said, if it was really about the baby's privacy, they wouldn't be posting as much as they do. I don't know how nobody finds this weird. Someone else said, he wants to post the child, Hallie does it. This is the middle ground. DDG did yes. respond back to the guy who made the original comment. He said, now why would I want to show your fat, your fat face ass, my baby, you irregular head shaped ass nigga mind your business and take that hot ass suede suit off <laughs> y'all if ddg don't play about nobody else y'all should have known he was gonna be 10 times worse with his own child uh, now why child would i want to show your fat face as my baby you irregular head shape ass mind your business and take that hot ass suede suit off ddg goes on to say people watch the proud family for 10 seasons without seeing wizard kelly face but tripping about me not showing my son's face Facts. shaking my head somebody else tweet ddg always got that damn baby it sends me every time we know who the breadwinner is i know the real king ddg respond what? lol y'all gotta stop with this broke talk with me y'all know damn well i'm having y'all leave y'all comments down below let me know what y'all think hold on got so bored got bored so i spent a quarter million on a tooth should have brought a house or something. I don't know why niggas trying to act like DDG broke. Y'all have no idea. When I, t when I say that nigga having, y'all don't understand. Y'all, <laughs> you're not going to understand. <laughs> that boy having, do you hear me? Having, been having, and a nerve for Snapchat to pull up and drop that bag on his ass. When it comes to that, yeah, now let's talk about CJ so cool because he posted a TikTok with Lexi two days ago, and supporters are shocked because sis said that she was done with CJ for good after he was texting her friend inappropriately. Everybody was spamming the chef is back. I don't know what to say because I'm confused. Y'all leave y'all comments down below. Let me know what y'all thinking when it comes to that. Now those couple of days while Lexi was gone, supposedly CJ was hitting up an IG model who does OF, and now the model is calling CJ out because she's claiming that he at first was sending her money, and now he's starting to ask to hang out. Now, she did tell him that she was single, but he's still consistently asking to hang out with her, even though he knows that she's married and it's becoming obsessive, according to her. Now, y'all leave out. What? Are you married or are you not married? What? Out because she's claiming that he at first was sending her money and now he's starting to ask to hang out. Now she did tell him that she was single, but he's still consistently asking to hang out with she her. She told him that she was married. Her, even though he knows that she's married and it's becoming obsessive according to He lucky I don't ask you to fuck. He's lucky I don't ask you to fuck. She say money don't excite everybody. Okay. It's not that serious, but if you want to keep sending money, that's cool with me. That would be cool with us. We would go out to eat every time you send some bread or get some. According to her. Now, y'all leave y'all comments down below. Let me know what y'all think when it comes to that. Two, 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 now that Jessica is single and done with Reed for good, her ex before Reed wants her back. People notice that he's been doing TikToks trying to get her attention. Someone said, get back with Jess. He respond, I wish twin. <laughs> Jess, mind your business. He'll recover and regroup. We don't go backwards. Today is Deara's birthday. Happy birthday to Deara. She's dropping her JT collab glasses Happy today birthday. at 12. I'm excited. Poor Reginald. How do we get DDG uh, in a, you know what? I'm not even going to ask. 
All right, what are we about to do next? Um, Cause you know we need eight of them. This five of them. Um, this fourteen minutes. Nah, T room. You got something? You got a short one, T room. Oh, I reacted to her yesterday. Die. All right, we're going to hit So Real T video. What is up, So Real gang? How are we doing today? Let's Here. get into the video. The other day, I reported that Amar and Maya had officially broken up. He even covered up the tattoo that he had got of her name and made it clear in the comments that he didn't forget about the other ones, and those will be covered up too. Oh, dang. The other day, Maya went live, and she was very emotional, and her friends was there to support her. While on live, she was talking to another friend that asked her about how long her and Amar have went without talking to to each other and then india cut the live off so, yeah. mm -hmm. so do, do y'all always do y'all break up and go days that i talk to each other and get back together it just be me like like i i just like he'll just blow up my phone and stuff like don't leave don't leave and stuff but this time like it's so that's a good friend right there so do so like do he be reaching out <laughs> Since then, Amar had stated on Twitter not to attach his name with no B-I-T-C-H. He also went live the other day. While on live with Jordan the other day, he stated that for his birthday trip, he will be bringing another vibe. Period. Since the breakup, Amar has just been out all smiles. This is the first time I've actually seen him post a picture where he actually showed his face smiling. or Y'all, the only reason why I'm saying this is because... He has spoken about her attitude several times. So that's the only reason why I would even bring it up again. But attitudes can damage a person's soul, gang. And don't get me wrong. Sometimes women do have a reason to have attitude on the period, pre or post. But not all the time. Not all month. You ain't got to be rude to me. None of that. You know what I'm saying? Um, and I just think that's why he happy anything like that and i'm guessing that's because he got a new girl the tea room have reported that amar jazz and two young ladies have been spotted out together well now nah, exactly i'm sorry friend. i love you i'm gonna go now bye <laughs> By the angle of where the person that was recording the video was sitting, you can see Linasia clear as day. For those of you that do not know who Linasia is, that is Rachel Wavy's ex-girlfriend. She was dating after she recently got out of a relationship with Deja. And for the Y'all, what the f that Amar and Jazz? Y'all, we definitely seen this yesterday. I don't think Amar's wrong at all for kicking it with another woman. And as far as Jazz being with Lanasia, <laughs> it does not seem like they are friends. It does not seem like Ray and Jazz are friends. So as far as I'm concerned, neither one of them owe each other loyalty. So I don't even know why Ray said that she wasn't going to judge or... um. Uh, what you call it? Um, smash or pass, crystal, whatever, because of jazz. Jazz is a Libra. That energy will never be the same. <laughs> they do what they want. <laughs> like, quite frankly, they, I ain't going to say none of them uh, have any loyalty, but mm, the Libras I've dealt with, boy, they have smashed your girlfriend at the same time sleep over y'all having together okay libras ain't shit and to the libras that's in the chat i ain't talking about all y'all i'm talking about the ones i've dealt with so if you feel like that was a stray just get hit friend get hit and they just twitter she has been stating for months she can't wait to come to houston the other day she posted two, two, two that in she was in Houston. Never would we have thought that she would be linking up with the Jazz. And Amar was with another female. So maybe this is the vibe that he stated that he will be bringing on his birthday trip. But you guys comment down below and let us know what you think. Did anyone see I'll this Lanasia and Jazz it. link up coming? You guys all know since Jazz has been single, she has been out enjoying herself and catching a few vibes. Not one time did we think Lanasia was one of them but they definitely wouldn't have thought it would have been lanasia no cap <laughs> but here we are real cute though but you guys comment down below and let us know what you think 
But anyways, let's get into the next topic. Ray So Wavy has finally dropped her new clothing brand. She will no longer be selling merch under the So Wavy apparel. Make sure you guys head over to her page and check that out. Ray did state on Twitter that she was so, so happy that she- Start my new brand from scratch was a risk. But the way y'all showing love and even trying to purchase before drop day is insane. I love y'all for real. I want to thank everybody who support me with this just the beginning. Took the risk and started her new brand because you guys are effing with it so hard. I'm so glad that she was finally able to drop her clothing brand. We have yeah, been waiting too. for this launch for so long. Make sure you guys head over to her page and check that out. I know she will be actually officially dropping the end of this month. So make sure you guys get your coins ready and comment down below and let us know what you think. Glad to see that Ray So Wavy and Talia are still going strong. They were also spotted out the other day at camp with Kiana and Armand. You guys leave your comments down below and let us know what you think. We chilling right now. Nah, we're not going to sleep. We up. we up, man. What's going on? He's so fucking happy. Talk to oh me. God. I'm not mad at him. I'm not mad at him at all. Oh, yeah, yeah. I ain't gonna start. We popping out of Chicago real soon. Real soon. We popping out of oh, Chicago. Oh, this is a full live of them. We popping out of Chicago real soon. No, that one is my second one. Oh, yeah. Hey, where y'all think I should go for my birthday? Talk to me. Where should I go for my birthday, bro? Talk to me. Listen. Man, bro, not coming my live with that stupid shit. You getting blocked. Oh, God. I don't know. Period. None of that. He was sick of it already. Uh, I don't know how many. Jordan, they say how many woods have you smoked? Man, at this point, I don't really know, guys. That's not wood. What? what are you talking about? Jaylon talking down on me? Yeah, that's a fucking wood. Jaylon said he has a wood. Ski. Uh -huh. so you don't smoke no more, brother? You just like me, brother. Yeah, yeah, I do. Go to New York. No, nigga, we trying to go out the country. We don't want to be nowhere in the U.S. I'm not being nowhere in the U.S. I'm leaving this bitch, bro. We leaving. I'm trying I to don't blame him. All right, y'all. I'm done with this video. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.